Hey everybody, this is Janice at Sada Sisters and today I'm going to show you how to build this easy and functional laptop computer stand. You can put your monitor on it, laptop on it, complete with its own cubbyhole for whatever you want, your cell phone, your mouse, whatever it is that you want to keep in there. And the best part is I use scrap wood and only two tools. So let's get started. For this project, you'll need scrap 1x8 boards and 10 corner braces. You'll also need a saw, a drill, wood glue, and some clamps. You will cut your 1x8s into a total of 5 pieces, 1 at 19 inches, 3 at 5 and a quarter inches, and one little one at 2 and 3 quarter inches. To assemble the piece, you will start with the two pieces that make up the cubby hole. Clamp them together with wood glue and use the corner braces to join the two pieces together. Then do the same thing to put together the main piece. I have a list of materials and printable plans available that you can get by clicking on the link in the description of this video. Now it's just a matter of putting the two pieces together like so. Don't forget the wood glue so that you can get that stronger joint. Now the stand is ready for sanding. I used my cordless cat sander for this part and made sure that the piece was smooth, especially around the edges. I then wiped it clean before I painted it. I opted for a simple matte black spray paint that I had on hand. Given that I built this piece during the quarantine, I was trying to use only materials that I had without having to go to the store. You can of course get creative with this and use paint or even stain if you prefer. And that's all there is to it. Pretty easy, right? I was actually surprised at how good it looked on the desk. The black goes really great with the rest of the furniture. The hairpin desk actually is also a DIY project, so you can find the link in the description if you like it. Hands down though, my favorite part about this project is the function. When I work from home, I use my laptop as a desktop by connecting it to a side monitor. And scrolling between the two screens was a pain because the screens just weren't parallel with each other. Now that my MacBook sits higher, it's a lot easier to find my way around with the mouse. And that little cubby hole is perfect for my phone so that hopefully I get less distracted by it. And I also love the extra space at the bottom. I slide things under there all the time that I'm using while I work, like books or my headphones. I just finished a conference call. And once I'm finished for the day, I have a place to slip everything in. I hope you like it. And if you like easy scrap wood projects like this one and simple affordable home improvement ideas, make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss a video. Hasta luego.